Hey guys, Tim Blackley here. We get asked all the time, what's our favorite color? You know, there's no easy answer to that. You know, you might be fishing in your farm pond at home. You might be fishing in your river system at home, or you might be on Mississippi Lake, or you might be on Kentucky Lake, like we are here. So, you know, I have a bunch of different favorite colors, but I'm going to tell you what works for us usually in the colors waters that we're at. In Mississippi, or if you're on a farm pond or wherever you're at and the water gets muddy or dingy, you know, I like an orange and chartreuse. Man, that, that's hard to beat. That's an orange and chartreuse Strike King Joker that is in a glow. Works great in Mississippi Lakes. Electric Chicken, that's a, a chartreuse in pink. Uh, works great in stained or muddy water. Black and chartreuse and purple sage. They are our two go-to colors when the water is clear. When I mean clear, if you can look down in, if you're in a boat and you look down in the water and you can see your prop, that's pretty daggum clear. So, you know, you want to go with some more solar colors and some smaller baits. Very important, clear water. You don't want to use a big old gobby bait because you won't get bit. You know, light has a major factor on catching crappie. You know, if you're night fishing at night, you know, a lot of people drop lights in, it draws them in us. But light conditions are very important and keep them in mind while you're fishing. You know, if it's bright, sunny, these fish are, if they got a place to hide under a boat dock, under a brush, under a stump, beside a stump in the shade, they're gonna move to where they're gonna have cover. Uh, they're very finicky about light conditions and, and how much light penetrates the water. So when you go crappie fishing, always keep that in mind and kind of keep, keep your eye on the sky, you know, see if it's cloudy, see if it's bright. So you always keep that in mind when you go fishing.